this is my recipe for healthy fish, chips and mushy peas. Yeah, we love it and you can have it in a healthy way. Let me talk you through the ingredients and then we'll get started. First of all I've got Albert Bartlett rooster potatoes and I've cut these into slim wedge shapes but I've kept the skin on. A lot of the vitamin C in these potatoes is just underneath the skin. We've also got some frozen peas some low-fat creme fraiche, some fresh mint chopped up. I've also got some fresh lemon thyme, my favourite herb. Some olive oil, some black pepper and some fresh lemons. And also for this dish, you need two good size, about seven ounce loins of cod or any meaty, chunky fish that's on good offer at your fishmongers today. So on this occasion, I'm going to use a roasting tray, but also a rack inside. And then I can just place the potato wedges on top. The air will circulate underneath and it gives you more of an oven chip, sort of baked feeling rather than a roast potato feeling. So if you've got one of those, give it a go. But if not, don't worry. The first job is to just drizzle a little olive oil over the potatoes. So I'm then going to use my hands to mix it up. It's the easiest way. So I've got the potatoes nicely coated in the olive oil. I'm actually not going to add any more flavour to this because the flavour of rooster potatoes themselves will be enough. It's really important cooking them this way that you don't have too many potatoes in the pan otherwise they won't all cook properly. So make sure you spread them out and if necessary put them in two roasting trays. So I've got the oven set at about 200 degrees centigrade and I'm going to pop these in the oven for about 35 minutes now. Okay, so I can hear the potatoes sizzling away in the oven. That's always a good sign. Now we're going to prepare the fish. So let's get started first of all with the olive oil. You really only need a tiny little drizzle of olive oil for this. It's just to stop the fish sticking when we're cooking it and also to help the pepper and the lemon thyme stick to the fish. And then some nice, fresh, unwaxed lemon zest. So the fish has been sizzling for two minutes on either side and I'm now going to pop it onto the baking tray and we'll pop it in the oven for 15 minutes to cook through. So while the potatoes and the fish are cooking in the oven, I'm now going to do the mushy peas. Peas are very, very good for you, very healthy. And I love them done this way. I use frozen peas and also for this dish, you've got the mint, the low fat creme fraiche and a bit of uh, lemon juice. The first thing is simply to boil your frozen peas for about six minutes, that's all they need. Now what we're going to add to this is a couple of tablespoons of freshly chopped garden mint and a couple of tablespoons of low fat creme fraiche and then simply the juice of half a lemon. And then your exercise for this hour is just a little bit of mushing. If you have problems getting your children to eat peas, this is a great way to give it a try because it's got a very gorgeous, delicious flavour and they actually don't feel that they're eating vegetables. So this is my healthy fish, chips and mushy peas. I've got the cod here that's done with some lemon thyme, lemon zest and a little bit of olive oil and black pepper. Baked beautifully so it's all nice and flaky. I've got the oven baked chips, which are a very simple flavor, just with a little bit of olive oil. Totally guilt free and delicious. Cooked with the skins on, remember, so you've got all the vitamin C in these Albert Bartlett rooster potatoes to nourish your bodies. And also then, of course, we've got the homemade mushy peas. So this is my very healthy fish, chips and mushy peas. I hope you enjoy it as much as I love it.